Louis, a valiant effort, especially from the perilous position you came in. How disappointed are you? Yeah, no, pretty, pretty disappointed. Um, you know, we probably weren't quite at it today with batting ball. Um, so yeah, we come away a little bit frustrated, obviously, with the result. Um, but I guess you've always got to look at, at positives as well. So you know, from the position we're in, um, you know, we had a, a decent partnership there with Coxie to get us kind of close, and then Scott at the end, um, who was striking them really well. Um, so yeah, no, it is, it is disappointed. Um, but you know, the good thing is we've got a game tomorrow. Uh, back at home against North Hans to, to put things right and hopefully get the victory. The way that you and Ben Cox played was really admirable given it was difficult to take risks when you're already five wickets down. Um, how well did he play, obviously, I think 85 together and, and the form that he's been at the minute? Yeah, no, unbelievable. Um, you know, I think we complement each other you know, really well. Um, obviously, I've got my strengths and then Coxie, again, has got his strengths. Um, you know, he's unbelievable square of the wicket, sweeping. Um, and you know he can hit the ball 360. So no, he's a joy to bat with. Um, keeps it nice and calm in the middle. Um, and yeah, no, can't speak of him highly enough, really. Obviously, you two were build, building momentum together in that middle phase. Maybe just got out just at the wrong time. How deep do you think you had to take it? Yeah, um, we're kind of saying just keep going, really. Um, you know, keep staying positive. If the ball is in in your strength, then hit it for four or six. If not, then look to hit twos, ones, etc. Um, so yeah, when I got out, when I did, it was pretty frustrating really, especially when I was only looking to hit it for a single really. Um, so yeah, no, it's, it's disappointing. Um, you know, in hindsight, it's a great thing. Probably would have tried, rather have tried to hit it for six really, but um, yeah, no, it's a shame we couldn't, couldn't quite get over the line. But you are striking the ball incredibly cleanly at the minute in uh, Red Bull cricket and in T20s. How much are you enjoying being out there of late? Yeah, no, good fun. Um, you know, really enjoyed my cricket. Um, I'm just trying to keep it simple, really. Um, you know, I'm quite lucky how I've got power, so I can always kind of fall back on that. Um, but yeah, no, it stems from good positions, I guess. Um, and yeah, just doing the basics, basics well, really. Keeping your head still, watching the ball, and, and just back yourself, yeah. Another positive out there, uh, with the ball this time was the way that our spinners play. I think Rahan uh, and Goldie together was eight overs, three for 45. How good were they? Yeah, no, they were they were both unreal today. Um, you know, Rahan coming back after a couple of weeks out, um, and then to bowl the way he bowled, you know, was awesome to see. Um, Goldie again, he's been good throughout this comp um, in those middle overs for us. Um, has turned into a really important player. So yeah, to get you know two important wickets as well, I think at that stage, um, you know, credit to him. He did a really good job. Three games to go now, we're probably going to need three wins. There's still belief up in that change room that we can do exactly that? Yeah, 100%. Um, you know, as I said, we've we come back tomorrow at home against Northampton um, and looking to put things right there. Um, and yeah, no, there's still, still loads of belief up in that dressing room. Um, and there's enough ability to, to win these three games of cricket for sure. And the fans will be very important for us, obviously, tomorrow uh, and Sunday at home. What kind of a difference do they make to the team when they're out in numbers and, and getting behind them? Yeah, no, massive. Um, we even had a, a little group here today, and you know they do do spur you on as well. Um, so yeah, no, it would be great to see as many people down at the Upton Steel County Ground as as possible, really, um, especially before the football happens on Sunday. So no, it'd be great to see as many faces down there as well, just to give a, a bit of added support to the lads, um, you know, because it really does help.